Hi folks, I'm Terry Tripler with some common sense from the heartland. Today is Wednesday, September 16th, and I hope you enjoy our new studios, our new office. We moved over the past two weeks, and the studio is a little bit simpler, a little bit smaller, just me and the tree. Uh, I was reading an ombudsman this week in which a lady and her mother had purchased tickets to go on a trip from one of the third-party travel sites, and after she purchased the tickets, she realized she had the wrong date. And so she contacted the travel site and they said, you'll have to contact the airline. In this case, it was Delta Airlines. And she contacted Delta Airlines and they said, I'm sorry, we can't make an exception. Uh, you can rewrite the ticket and there will be a fee. And the ombudsman took up her case. And that's what an ombudsman should do. And, and took up her case and, and has said that the uh, you know, airline apologists, referring to people like me, if not just me, would say, uh, what did you think non-refundable meant? Or what part of non-refundable didn't you understand? Well, yes, I've said that quite often. And here's another situation. You made a mistake. Now, if Delta makes an exception, where do they draw the line? I mean, can you imagine the world's largest airline and how many tickets they must be selling a day? So how many people must be coming to them every day to make an exception? I mean, it, it, it would, they might as well throw the non-refundable rules out the window because soon it would, um, everybody would realize, hey, you can just call Delta and make a change. Now Delta would have to hire several hundred uh, reservations agents just so you'd have somebody there to handle mistakes. They have to make a decision and they have to draw a line. And a number of years ago, the airlines did draw a line and said no waivers and no favors. And they, they've had to do that simply to maintain the integrity of the non-refundability of their tickets. So while it's unfortunate that this happened to this person, nevertheless, Delta must hold the line. So again, what it does, what it does teach us, it teaches us, yes, one, that Delta's gonna hold the line, but two, let's make doubly sure we have our dates correct and the names and every bit of information before we purchase that ticket. Then we won't have a problem. I'm Terry Tripler, and folks, to me, this is just common sense.